the Rokai and CN banner is gonna get a rerun from tomorrow and we are gonna make a nice overview about the units and if it is worth to summon on this banner or not. First of all, I would say the banner is okay um, or good in particular, you know, because the units are strong, uh, somewhat strong, you know, and uh, all of them have a place in the game, but I wouldn't suggest summoning, you know, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I wouldn't suggest summoning unless um, some of these units are your favorite characters, you know, Shinji is strong, Kisuke is strong, right? Uh, we're gonna talk about them in a, in a bit, right? The banner is gonna be a 25 step banner format. Um, you know, the first one is gonna be 150, 200, and you know, the vibes after then. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the characters, right? CN grants the problem starts from the first strong attack, however, he has a lot of burning damage and damage to the less rated enemies as well. It's inflicting a lot, but I still don't understand why this character haven't gotten a normal potion increase and he has only the super pots right first strong attack kind of bad but you have the value right there if you desperately need a heart super potion unit i would say uh we have better replacements i think nini is still a little bit more valuable uh, when she has the killer and uh, the thing is uh, kaname just got released right now in my opinion kaname is better and uh yeah only if you want cn that much if you like him that much other than that we have roka as well a perfect super character for it's shared complete immunity revive on the special move other than that nothing too much to say she heals the team as well by 20 percent every single time when you're changing the room but yeah again nothing too insane right here you know none of these characters are gonna be game breaking shinji still lives up to this day beautiful strong attacks and a valued skill set some people have him 5-5 and he holds his own even right now other than that kisuke is gonna have a homing vortex for the second strong attack you know with an explosion as well the start when you're activating the attack and uh, other than that he has problems with the first attack yeah but he has a good you know skill set in general that uh, kind of holds him up you know with the paralysis and laceration good sorry per killer unit but uh, definitely the power attribute has been stacked in these couple of years regarding the sorry per killer thing you know Ista not a good unit other than the potion thing that he has uh, nothing too much to say uh, Don Kanonji again uh, not a good unit he's just kind of fun you know, driving with the car and stuff like that. Nothing to be saying. Mayuri can be used in guild quests. He's he's good in um like co-op as well and stuff like that. But nothing to game breaky. Gijo, good character on the side in guild quest. Good normal attack damage unit if you like those type of characters. And uh, at the last, Tsukishima is gonna be a brave battle character. He's still definitely annoying to face if you're using characters that cannot break the invincibility, or you're gonna try to like run a SP based team. Right. Other than that, as I said before as well. Uh, unless you like these characters that much or whatever, I would highly suggest summoning on uh, something else uh, in the pool selection, for an example, today, because today is going to be the last day that you get summoned on the pool, right? Or maybe trying to get Toshiro, um, Kaname, stuff like that, right? Kaname is a better version of CN, definitely really, really insane heart attribute farmer, and Toshiro is just a way stronger character than Roka. You know, uh, I would suggest, um, you know, summoning on those instead, but you get the point, man. And if you like these characters that much, definitely go for them uh, because they are valuable to have and they are good. But as I said before, nothing too insane, if you know what I mean. Hey, if you're still going to summon, you know the vibes, man. Good luck, bro. And hopefully you're getting what you want. I'm going to personally skip it. And uh, yeah, man, thank you guys for watching it. Hopefully you're going to have a great day slash night wherever you are. And I will see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.